for a country like Uganda, we are lagging behind as far as digital skills is concerned. Just a few years ago, in 2021, we did the National Labor Force Survey. And one of the findings of the, that survey was very disturbing for me. 87.9% of our population who are aged 10 years and above have never accessed the internet. But we are speaking about the digital age. But the very basic uh, one, which is access, is not possible for quite a number of us. The challenge of youth employment is, is a significant challenge uh, in many African countries, including in Uganda. And it's a challenge that cannot be tackled by one single actor, by one single uh, stakeholder. So there is a need for uh, a collaborative approach from all the segments of our societies, the private sector, the civil society, the government and the international organization. We've done a lot of thinking and we have studied the roadblocks of entrepreneurs despite the abundance of support and uh, government may not be providing, but all these friends of ours are providing a lot of these opportunities. We are seeing very few sustainable uh, uh, businesses coming out of our innovations. And so we have support services advisory on how to go to get funds. We call it uh, preparing, uh, pr we prepare uh, innovators and uh, small businesses for funding. 